E-Readers vs. Books by Ava, Jillian, Genya, Urtaza, and Sam. Hello, today we will be discussing whether e-readers or books are more convenient. First, we will be showing some pros and cons about e-readers. Pro. Instead of carrying a lot of books, you can just carry a light Kobo or Kindle. Con. Books don't give out light, so you can't read during the night. Pro. You don't need to charge a traditional book. Con. E-readers cost about $150, without including the books you have to buy after that. Although we have different opinions about pros and cons, we've all come to one conclusion. Personally, I do not enjoy reading on an iPad or an e-reader as much as I do at, on a book. I enjoy reading on a book more because it feels more natural to hold compared to holding a big piece of electronics. I think I like books more because they can't be broken as easily when you walk around with them compared to e-readers. They don't need to be charged or use Wi-Fi to work. Also, they aren't as heavy. It also feels more better to be holding a book. A book costs about 5 to $10, while buying a book on a Kindle will cost $160 because you have to buy a Kindle also. So do I think it's worth it? That's no. I believe that books are much better. I think they're stronger than e-readers and more efficient. And when you have the book, you have a much different feel. One last thing. Books don't hurt your eyes as when you read, so you can read a long time on a book and not get your eyes hurt. But for one hour staring at an e-reader, your eyes will start to hurt. So what do I prefer? Books. I prefer books mostly because I like the feel of them in my hands. Plus, if you're the kind of person who likes to lend books to friends, it will be much harder with an e-reader. What if your friend lost the e-reader? They're really expensive. So, on the whole, I prefer books. My personal opinion is that I like books better. Although e-readers may be convenient and time-saving, I still prefer traditional books. You can easily find a summary or a small paragraph about the author in a book jacket that is not available in an e-book. You can borrow a book from a library and not have to pay anything at all, but to read an e-book, you must buy an e-reader first. Our opinion is books. What is yours?